morning, this is your girl Shay. This is my second time recording this because I'm recording from my phone and morning times my phone rings a lot. So I'm going to go over again what I was discussing. My topic today is the proper undergarment. I have an array of underwear. I have everything from boy shorts to un um, regular panties, g-strings, thongs, um, crotch lifts. An array of underwear. I feel like all women should or do have an array of um, underwear for different occasions. Because I might want to wear something that, you know what I'm saying, I don't want any line showing. I got seamless underwear. That'd be good for like a G-string situation. Um, just have you an array. Um, something that is very important to my underwear collection is going to be my control top underwear. My control top panties are not a girdle situation. They are for control, not for the sucking in and the, you know, um, creating this different illusion. What it does is, if you have, um, if you don't have like a real tight stomach area, then what it does is it holds you snug. So if I got on a t-shirt, let's say I got one of those little t-shirt dresses, and I'm walking, my stack on my stomach or my back is not just doing its own thing off in the zone. So it kind of controls your top area. A place that has good control top underwear is going to be Burlington Co. Factory. They have a Marilyn Monroe line. Ross also has good control top, and so does um, Marshall. And have I got that from TJ Maxx? TJ Maxx does too. But Burlington is going to be your one stop shop. Well, down here it is, rather. Um, so, my control tops come in different kinds. Like they come in colors black, gray, beige. Um, brown, and black ones, I got black ones for days. Like, I got these one black ones, and they have, like, little sticks on the inside of them, kind of like what the corsets has, and those, um, kind of contour my size a little bit more. Um, yeah, central top underwear are, um, a necessity, especially if you were thick sister. Ain't nothing sad about me. Um, I'm just thick. And, um, and I like to look nice in my clothes. I see a lot of women that have the um, muffin top. I think my coworker call it a roofer. A roofer. I don't know what she call it, but a muffin top or like a little kangaroo pouch. A control top will help that situation. I did pick it up a little. That might be a girdle situation, but um, I don't know if it is or if it ain't, but I ain't there yet. Lord, I ain't there. But you know what I'm saying, just in case you like you are, that might be more a girdle situation. I'm not sure what effect a control top undergarment would have on that type of situation down here. Um, but it does help everything in real snug, real tight. It keeps you good. It keeps your clothes fitting really, really nice. So, like, for real to help back during, they normally buy the dressing rooms where the undergarment lingeries are. Get your, get your size now. Now, um, I usually get either a large or an extra large, depending on how much gear they got in it, because um, I just don't want to be snugged up with something that's killing me. I still got to be comfortable, you know, and presentable in my clothes at all times. So, that's my tip of the day. Get your ass some control top pins if you ain't where you want to be. Now, um, I don't see them as a permanent situation. Like, like, I'm about to get my workout on and get my little six-pack, and I, okay, that might have been over top. I'm going to get my little workout on, keep me a pack of something on, and um, get to a point, hopefully, where I won't use control top or utilize control top underwear. But it's nothing to be shamed about if you do wear them. Shit, it's something to be shamed about if your ass ain't wearing them or you're right here shaking and jiggling everywhere. I do feel bad. Honey. But, you know, who... Um, you can't even see the real color of this lipstick, so I don't even know if I want to tell you what it is, but it's the Wet and Wild, um, I think I said, I'm going to do a favorites video, so it'll be in a favorites video, but it's not this color, but anyway, all I have on is some foundation in it, hold it up, hold it up, oh, I can't wait to look back at this video and see my damn face when I see that pony scar. <laughs> But anyway, um, I'm going to do a favorite video real soon, and this lipstick will be in a favorite video. My foundation will be in it. My mascara will be in it. So, yeah. Bye.
probably before, uh, within the next three or four days, I'll be doing a favorite video. I'll probably have to do a couple of them. My earrings are from, oh, my earrings are from the beauty supply store. They were like $4.99. And then, um, I went to this boutique that be having real hot to death earrings. And she had them for $14.99. Want to bust her bubble, but I'm gonna let her do her. She might have some customers that don't visit beauty supply stores and they might not know it no better. And they might be jumping off on that $14. But your girl shape no better. I'm gonna do better. With that said and done, rate, comment, subscribe. I told y'all I was back and I was doing more videos. It is what it is. My pose is holding up pretty separate as well. You know, I still got my little bomb situation. I'm going to go in and focus on this road, but y'all caused me to have an accident and trying to go to a YouTube video. Right, then it should be on old world star hip hop or some shit. Media take out and all that. Girl, did you see that girl died? No, I'm sorry. Let me not even speak that into the atmosphere. Y'all have a blessed day. It is what it is. It's your girl Shakes. Um, follow me on Twitter at Madam Shakes, M A D A M S H A K E S. And, uh,